So today is a good day, guys. Remember a few videos back, I said I was gonna order a weightlifting belt? Well, I ordered it, and guess what? It finally got here. I'm so excited to start using this for my deadlifts and my squats, cause it's gonna really help me stay tired throughout the movements and everything. I'm just kidding, guys. I'm not excited to use this because, I mean, I would be, but guess what? It does not fit me. Order medium, it's like a waist 30, 33, and look. <sighs> No matter how hard I try to squeeze into this thing, I'm not gonna fit into it. So, gonna go to the UPS, send this back because the bulk is real. I'm getting a little chubby now. I know you guys can see it in my face, but getting chubbier, so I'm gonna need to get a large, which is like a waist 34 to like I don't really know, you know what, you know the the range or whatever. I just know size 34. And I know that that's definitely gonna fit me. I would keep that for later, like when I cut, because I know I'm probably gonna fit that when I cut. But I, I want to get one now because I just want to keep it. When the time comes, if I do need to get a smaller one for when I cut, because I'm pretty sure the large won't fit me anymore, I would do that. But now I'm going to send it back, which I hate doing. I know I cannot be the only one who hates sending things back. Because you waited to get it, you were so excited, and now you got to send it back. Wait for it to get to them, then wait for it to get back to you. It takes forever. But anyways, going to go to UPS. Ah, going to go to UPS, send it back, and get this day started. So let's go, guys. here well Renzo's about to leave because he's really hungry he needs to get his food I'm getting Pan Express and Chipotle what yeah I'm getting it so see you later so as you guys can see I came to the shop to you know eat lunch with my my little baby brother right there he's not that short so like but he is pretty short so <laughs> and, oh yeah guys I don't know if you can tell but I did get a new hairstyle hopefully I do like it because I love it I used to have this hairstyle about a year ago yeah almost a year ago now so I want to come back to this look the thing I don't like about this is because look how big my forehead is like, uh, people call me five head. Brandon compares his, I well, since I have the iPhone now, we compare the iPhone 6S Plus to my 4S. It's pretty much the same size, so, <laughs> you know. It's that brotherly love. Well, I got a big nose, he always tells me, so we gotta embrace it. Look at forehead, nose. Oh, hey, get it from my so dad, high. get it from our dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we got haircuts because we're going somewhere this weekend. We wanna, look, we wanna look nice for the weekend, so you guys have to stay tuned, wait for it. I'm pretty sure next video we'll tell you guys, but you'll find out eventually, so. See you at the gym.
hope that looks like really cool for you guys because I haven't done an edit like that before. I mean, I have, but on my 6 Plus and since I got my MacBook, I was like, oh, I want to create something that looks super cool because I always see people like edit super good and everything. I was like, whoa, that looks sick. So I want to do something like that for you guys. So hopefully, so hopefully it came out good. I'm still learning, but hopefully it didn't look like crap. Yeah, guys, so now we're going to talk about the workout. So we were, I just had something I was doing on bench press. I was doing 180 pounds, and it went up pretty smooth. Like, during, I know on my last day I was getting, like, kind of tired, and that's natural. But I know I could have probably gone up to 185 pounds. But like I said, I mean, like, I, I couldn't really, I didn't want to do it because I didn't have a spotter. You know, usually Brandon's my spotter, but since we were recording and everything, I didn't want to try to injure myself or hurt myself. So I just played it safe, and the rest of the workout went pretty good. I'm happy how everything turned out to be. Yeah, for me, bench, I did 150 for three... No, four sets of four, one set of five, and one set of three. And that's really good because before I did 155, the most I could get was like like three at the most, and it was like a real struggle. So I'm improving. I'm pretty sure I could win for five, but like Renzo said, I was keeping it conservative. So, you know, just, you know, if I couldn't really push it, I need a spotter so, you know, I didn't have one, like you said. So it went really good. Dumbbells could have went better, but, you know, I always have a problem with incline. It's just like that here because the Amphim, the incline is like this. Like I can do it like this, and here is like this. So it's just, it just throws me off a lot, but I'll try to work on that. But yeah, this is the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I really hope you do enjoy this video. I'm pretty sure Brandon is gonna edit this pretty good. He's gonna put, I know he's gonna put a lot of effort into this. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be up. I'm gonna be up for a while because I wanna make sure it looks good. I'm gonna try my best, my best possible to do it. Like I'm not gonna, you know, go to sleep like if, if it looks bad. If it looks bad, I'm not gonna put it up. Let's just put it like that. No, it's gonna look good. I know it. And if you didn't enjoy this video, please make sure you click the thumbs up button. I know you see it, so you click it. Don't believe anything. Yeah. If you see it, click it. Listen to him. Exactly. And if you haven't subscribed, then please do it. I appreciate it. We appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye for more. Bye for more. We're out.